Greatest Weakness, one of my finest stories. I hope you enjoy as it begs the question, what is your greatest weakness? A 10 year old boy decided to study judo despite the fact that he had lost his left arm in a devastating car crash. The boy began lessons with an old Japanese judo master. The boy was doing well, so he couldn't understand why, after three months of training, the master had taught him only one move. Sensei, the boy finally asked, shouldn't I be learning more moves? This is the only move you know, but this is the only move you'll ever need to know, the sensei replied. Not quite understanding, but believing his teacher, the boy kept training. Several months later, the sensei took the boy to his first tournament. Surprising himself, the boy easily won the first two matches. The third match proved to be more difficult, but after some time, his opponent became impatient and charged. The boy deftly used his only move to win the match. Still amazed by his success, the boy was now in the finals. This time, his opponent was bigger and stronger. Concerned that the boy might get hurt, the referee called a timeout. He was about to stop the match when the sensei intervened. No, the sensei insisted, let him continue. Soon after the match resumed, his opponent made a critical mistake. He dropped his guard. Instantly, the boy used his move to pin him. The boy had won the match and the tournament. On their way home after the match, the young boy asked, Sensei, how did I win the tournament with only one move? You won for two reasons, the sensei answered. First, you've almost mastered one of the most difficult throws in all of judo. Second, the only known defense for that move is for your opponent to grab your left arm. How can your biggest weakness become your greatest strength?